let's prove the trig identity. We're going to start off here and we're going to convert the left side here into simpler terms. So one plus secants the same thing as one over cosine theta all over one over cosine theta. And what we're going to do here is we're going to multiply through by by a cosine. So we're going to have times cosine theta cosine theta. And what we'll have is cosine theta plus one over one. Now this part sounds a little counterintuitive. This right here, it's just cosine theta plus one. Well, sure enough, but we need to keep proving till we get what we have on the top there. So what we're going to do here, I have cosine theta plus one. Um, we're going to take this times the conjugate, so cosine theta minus one over cosine theta minus one, which is basically one. But this becomes um, this becomes cosine. Actually, let me redo this here. Um, that's not going to work. Let me erase this. It's the right format, but I got to redo this. It should actually be should be one plus cosine theta. All right, here we go. So then we have one minus cosine theta over one minus cosine theta, which ends up being one minus cosine squared theta. And then we have one minus cosine theta. And this is sine squared theta plus cosine squared theta equals one, and then one minus cosine squared theta is equal to sine squared theta. And this becomes sine squared theta all over one minus cosine theta. That's it.